everyone this is geeta and welcome back to my channel so let me start by apologizing that i'm not uploading my videos regularly so now i'm going to try my best to upload videos at least once a week today i'm going to talk about healthy hair care routine tips and tricks i'm going to share my own experience of how i managed to make my hair healthy and long today which was not so a year ago honestly i never thought that i would have long hair because i used to have very short dull and thin hair however hard i tried to grow my hair beyond a certain length it kept falling drying up and splitting but soon i discovered a secret to beautiful hair and that i'm going to share with you so keep watching tip number 1 oiling hair regularly oiling hair regularly is the most effective treatments for hair problems including hair loss split ends frizz dullness thinning and graying of hair i'm going to take this coconut oil that is lukewarm you can warm it by putting it in microwave for 30 to 40 seconds Now I am going to apply this oil with the help of my fingertips to my root first and then the rest of my hair and massaging it for 15 to 20 minutes. Massaging the scalp and hair with lukewarm oil helps rejuvenate it and combats the loss of health due to chemical treatments. Coconut oil is rich in carbohydrates, vitamins and minerals which are good for the hair and body both. Coconut oil helps to make hair strong, nourished and protected from the effect of premature aging like baldness and excessive hair loss. Cleansing hair properly Healthy and clean hair follicles are very important to maintain healthy hair and promoting a hair growth. Without proper cleansing building up from a styling product, oil and dead skin cells can accumulate on your scalp causing flakings, greasy appearance and slower your hair growth. For that apple cider vinegar is the best option. Before shampooing I use apple cider vinegar mixed with equal amount of water and rinse my hair with this mixture. I wait for 30 minutes and then shampoo it. Apple cider vinegar contains natural alpha hydroxy acid which gently exfoliate the scalp and hair allowing for removal of dead skin cells and build up that can occur from sweat or conventional hair products. This improves the appearance of the hair, reduces itchiness and dandruff and allows for better styling. deep conditioning conditioning hair is very important for healthy hair it make your hair strong shiny and beautiful inside and out you can use ingredients according to your hair condition but here i am showing you the treatment for oily hair for that i am taking one egg white one full tablespoon of amla powder one tablespoon of coconut oil one tablespoon of yogurt or curd and 1 teaspoon of lemon juice i mix all the ingredients well to get a paste form now i'm going to apply this to my root first and then the rest of my hair if you want you can use brush but i'm more comfortable using my hand i'm going to leave this mask for at least 30 to 40 minute since there is an egg in it i will wash my hair with normal tap water to remove the mask and then shampoo it if possible go with natural or chemical free product avoid sulfates and alcohol in your shampoo or conditioner tip number 5 don't comb your hair when it is wet wet hair is extremely delicate and should be handled with care When you get out of the shower, pat and squeeze your hair dry with an absorbent towel when you are finished washing it. Avoid scrubbing it dry which can rough up the hair cuticles and tangle your hair into knots. Pat it gently or twist your hair into a towel. Choose a white tooth comb to comb your hair. 
Comb your hair by starting at the ends to gently work any tangles or knots so they are smooth. Once the section has been properly worked and smooth, move up higher and higher until your hair has been combed neatly. Hair trimming. Trim your hair every two months to get rid of those brown and split ends. Cut about one fourth an inch of your hair every eight to ten weeks to get rid of split ends, which cause hair to break off thus preventing your hair from getting longer. Back away from heating toes. I have very straight hair, so I hardly ever use heating tools to style my hair. Heat styling tools can dry out your hair which can lead to split ends, brackets and overall damage. If you are going to style your hair with a hot tool, make sure you use a heat protecting spray first. Tip number 8. Eating right. A healthy diet also helps your hair stay strong and shiny. Add fruits and green vegetables, eggs, lentils, beans and nut to your diet. Fruits and green vegetables are low in calories and fats but contain good amount of vitamins and minerals. All the green, yellow, orange vegetables are rich sources of calcium, magnesium, potassium, iron, beta carotene, vitamin B complex, vitamin C, vitamin A and vitamin K. Eggs are good source of biotin and other B vitamins that help control hair loss. Lentils and beans are a great low calorie source of protein, fiber, B vitamins, vitamin C, zinc and minerals which are essential for hair growth. Nuts contain a wide variety of nutrients including protein, vitamins, minerals and some healthy fats. Sunflower seeds contain plenty of hair loss preventing nutrients including protein, zinc, selenium, biotin, iron, B vitamins, vitamin E, magnesium and calcium. They are also high in omega-6 fatty acids. Tips number 9. Hydrate yourself. Water helps the body process and flush out toxins faster which makes it quick and easy natural method to make your hair grow a lot faster and healthier. I don't necessarily like drinking water unless I am thirsty, but these days I'm seeing a lot about fruit infused drink and I tried out and it is really good. For that you can use any citric fruits along with cucumber, lemon and mint. I'm going to make this by using what I have available in my kitchen. I'm using cucumber, star fruits, orange and mint leaves. And my fruit infused detox water is ready. So drink away to help. Tip number 10. Add activities to your daily routine. Stress is another big cause of hair thinning and bonds. It could be emotional, physical, related to family and relationship, financial and job related. I also have been through some stress. I think today's lifestyle is very stressful with almost every third person going experiencing it in some form. Adding some activities to your daily lifestyle helps deal with stress. You can add activities that you enjoy like dancing, gaming, cycling, running, yoga or any other sports. I have a very busy lifestyle but I still take out time for my everyday activities of walking and jogging. I also do some yogic exercise like the pranayama. I love meditation. It has really changed my life. Tip number 11 is proper sleep. Good sleep plays a vital role in good health and being well throughout our life. Getting enough quality sleep at the right time can help protect your mental health, physical health and quality of life. You need at least 7 to 8 hours of sleep. Good sleep helps you to keep fresh all day long, be energetic in your mind and body. 
feel happy and be healthy and it has its benefit in skin and hair care too. I also have hard time falling asleep but I'm using the following method during bedtime to help me sleep on time. I use an aroma lamp with tea candle and I light it on 20 minutes before I enter into my bedroom with my favorite fragrance. I avoid using cell phone and computer at night. Lastly, there is nothing like a reading good book to make me sleep faster. Last but not the least, tip number 12, consult your doctor. After doing all these things and you find yourself still suffering from hair loss, so please do consult your doctor. You might be suffering from thyroid disease, anemia, autoimmune diseases and hormone issues that can cause changes to or loss of hair. So guys tell me how do you like this video by writing a comment in a comment section and if you enjoyed this video so give this video a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed my channel yet so do subscribe now to get notification of my future uploads. Thank you so much for watching and see you in my next video. Till then, bye!